Hello and welcome to this tutorial. Now we're going to be talking and hopefully helping you fix the Modern Warfare or Warzone um, horrible your operating systems not supported DirectX 12 error message. Now it's very annoying. Um, I've got an AMD graphics card. It's an RX 700 XT um, and hopefully this works um, for you guys and your AMD graphics cards as well. So if you feel at the end of the video that it's helped you, please hit that like button and subscribe for more. Thank you very much. Let's get down to it. Right, so the first thing you guys need to do is to click on Battle.net so that you can get into the Modern Warfare Warzone game. Now some of the bits I'm going to be telling you guys to delete some files and but don't worry because we'll, we'll get them back. But I'm not going to tamper with mine because it works now. So and hopefully it will work for you guys. I just don't really want to tamper with it anymore because I'm enjoying the game. So what I did is I went into options, game settings, go into game settings and type this code nice and easy and then press done. Lovely. Next thing you do is go into options, go into show and explorer, click into your file Call of Duty Modern Warfare and delete from this file all the way including Modern Warfare Launcher and Modern Warfare itself. So delete, so click and delete all of those files. So you just have those top three only in, in the files. Just do that, that's the, that's, that's the next step. Then if you go into your documents, again, Modern Warfare and delete the players. So just right click and delete that one as well. Again, don't panic because we're gonna do something next which will um, get all the files back. So once you've done that, if you go into options and then click scan and repair. Now what that will do is that will scan and re-put all those files and update them and put them back on to your Modern Warfare system. So this really helped for me. Obviously check to see if there's any updates through um, Blizzard, but there probably shouldn't be. You've probably already checked that anyway. Also yesterday there was a new, which it worked for me yesterday, there is a new, so if I click onto my AMD software, now there has been a brand new um, AMD uh, graphics card driver to update. So it's 20.5.1. Now, when I went into this this morning, when the update came out, I pressed check for updates and it didn't come up. So what I did is I just went into AMD driver oh, updates and the top tab. I just went onto my graphics card. So it's the 5,700. It's the XT model and then press submit. Now obviously just click on whichever one yours is. So press submit. I've got Windows 10. Again, if you've got Windows 7, then, then click on Windows 7. But I've got Windows 10 and there it is, the new 20.5.1. Now before I had that one there, which still says recommended, but in my opinion, I mean, it, it might not work for you, but it worked for me. I, I updated it straight away and it's now working for me this morning. So again, download that update that it will ask you to res uh, res restart your computer to, to, to get it going but that is it that is all i done and then now when i click onto my game it still shows the notification so which i'll show you so it still shows your operating system is not supported still the same message so click no and again, it says the same thing with the DirectX 12 and your operation system does not support. Now, just, just, just ignore it and just press OK. It will load up. And as you can see, it's now working, guys. So hopefully this worked for you. And if it did, again, hit that like button and hit that subscribe button for me. And if it hasn't, you're more than welcome to pop a comment below um, and we can try and figure this out together guys because this has been one of the most annoying things for me to figure out So I hope you enjoyed it and thank you very much and I hope you enjoy you know playing your game. Goodbye